Taguan it stands for SAG1, which is a solid aqua fortress group. Taguan started when the original members from the previous group wanted to get back into rowing, which led to a reunion row in Thailand back in 2010. We inherited it, made it like a racing team, which is very, very competitive right now. There are 70 current members of Taguan. 55 of those are males and 45% are females. Our members come in different fields and industries. Some are IT and engineers, some are architects, others are from sales, advertising, and finance. And we even have students like me and young professionals who just graduated. We encourage each other to discover one's athleticism, promote team sports and discipline to all members. Unlike in any other sports, the individual strength doesn't matter here. What matters is how synchronized the boat is. In order to win, you have to paddle as one. We highly encourage those who have not yet tried the sport to join or just even try. No need to prepare or be physically fit or anything. Just show up in our training schedule and we will get you started. My sister has been paddling for quite some time now and she's very passionate about it and passion is contagious so I figured uh, I should try it out as well. Well, Saguan right now is a very, very competitive team. I'm Cheryl Nepomuceno, a homegrown father of Saguan Dragon Boat Team. I'm Alexandria Muyot and I'm a paddler of Saguan Dragon Boat Team. I'm June Formalejo and I'm a homegrown father of Saguan Dragon Boat Team. I'm Miko Lara. I'm the team captain of Saguan Dragon Boat. We are solid! We are one! We are Saguan! Uma!